Back, the region's largest COVID-19 testing site closes today. Looking live from our South Bank Skycam, more than 40,000 people have been tested at Lot J outside TIAA Bank Field since the site opened back in March. The operation now moves to the Regency Square Mall, begins tomorrow, but that is not the only new testing site in the re region. A couple more open this week. So News for Jack's reporter Jennifer Reddy is live in Mandarin. And Jennifer, this new city run, city run site is set to open today. Good morning. That site here at the Mandarin Senior Center is scheduled to open in just a few hours, and it's one of several new testing sites opening this week here in the River City. And the mayor says this will really allow for more people to get tested in the community. This morning, the city of Jacksonville is expanding testing in the River City. Uh, we were going to expand testing to make sure the entire community had access. A walk-up testing site will open today at Mandarin Senior Center. It's the second new city-run testing site to open this week. On Monday, a site opened inside Jim Fortuna Senior Center in Ed Austin Regional Park. Starting tomorrow, people can get tested at the beaches. A walk-up site is slated to open at the old Kmart Shopping Center on Atlantic Boulevard. All three sites are expected to be open for the next six months, and the mayor says three additional sites will open very soon. The new sites will allow for thousands of additional tests to be conducted each day. This comes as Lot J prepares to close after being open for several months, some days seeing hours-long waits. The site will move to the Regency Square Mall and reopen tomorrow. Three federally run sites at Regency, First Coast High School, and Frank H. Peterson Academies will stay open through Friday. Since these additional testing sites have opened, the wait times at sites like Lot J have gone down significantly. On Tuesday, officials say more than 1,300 active virus swab tests were conducted at Regency, 838 at the West Side testing site, nearly 600 at the North Side site, and 290 at Lot J. Appointments for the federal sites can be made through do I need a COVID-19 test.com. And the testing site here this morning opens at 11 o'clock. It will be open Monday through Friday. You do not need an appointment, but it is encouraged. We have all of that information on our website, newsforjacks.com. Jennifer Reddy, Channel 4, the local station.